Should be running the opposite way, Professor Slave. Oh, there you are. Ah, way. True to Pi's... True to Pi's car. We're not going in there, Bill. You... Okay, fine. We're going, Bill. That's not... Ready to die for your cut. what you want in Bellevue, Bill. But this is what you wanted. Oh, God. I do not have the right ammunition for this. I don't have the right ammunition for any of this. <laughs> gotta be sure. Is he even here? Bellevue, get up. What are you doing? You bleeding out of your ass again? Stop bleeding out of your ass, Bellevue. Here. Now let's get out of here. Bellevue. I swear to God, you, you show one dickhead frozen in time. Let's... Let's just get out of here. Bellevue. Bellevue, we're going inside. That's barbed wire. Don't rub your face against it. All right, Bellevue Bill. This is Freeside. They sell giant rad roach assholes. That's what Steve is. So don't, you know. I have snacks if you're hungry. Just let me know. This is the fort. I don't know if you want to go inside or whatever. I mean, I'm not. I'm done with going inside places. Followers of the apocalypse, huh? These guys some kind of fucking cult or something? I mean, I guess. Jesus, Bellevue Bill. Nah. What's their agenda? Passing out Bibles? Helping people? I mean, they, they help people more. They do humanitarian work, trying to undo the damage of the Great War. They offer medical services. I don't really know. Books, medicine, maybe I don't deal with them. They're sneering pussies who expect handouts. Uh... Oh, like a charity? All right, all right. I can dig it. My brother was in the Peace Corps and shit. Can we take a peek inside? Yeah, let's do it. Let's go in. Sweet. Let's go. Sweet. Let's dance. So this is the Peace Corps. That's a Peace Corps member. Is that good? Is that everything you wanted to see? Here's some hobos. These hobos needed our help like 18 years ago. Here's another tent. This is filled with invisible hobos. I don't like to deal with them. This is the radiation chamber. As you can see, just radiation barrels all over. They might say it's water. Don't believe Hello. them. Here's some more hobos. These are the upper class hobos. Here's some, uh, this is Doctor. I used to travel with him. Not anymore. More invisible hobos. And invisible hobos. And a lady. Alright, I think we got one more place, everyone. So this is a strip. Those are some floating bushes. Those are always there. Disregard that. And that's the death robot that greets you. Any questions? Any questions about the death robot? Death robot. Wow, the strip. I mean, it looks run down, but I remember all this shit. My buddy Red got super sauced at the tops, puked, and got us 86th. Is that code for... I remember the Lucky 38, too. We hung out in there for a little bit. Ah, <sighs> It's all coming back to me now. It looks secure. Is this place pretty safe? Pretty safe, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, 24 hour security from both the NCR and Mr. House's Securitrons. Well, it's certainly the nicest place I've seen so far. Give me the scoop on the strip currently. It's mostly cookies and cream, and I'm okay with that. It's Mr. House's personal sanctuary for the advancement of humanity. Mr. House and three families all own and operate these casinos. Mr. House puts this together as collateral. Uh, yeah. I remember House. He was a young entrepreneur, had some robot company, big business, big deal, supposedly. That was 200 years ago, though. This must be a great-great-grandson or something. Can we go inside and see what it's like? This one, yes. And I have no other option. Sweet. Let's go. Let's dance. Do you want any stim packs, by the way? Like, I got a thousand of them. On second thought, I guess I'm going to head to that Mormon fort. It looks like the best bet to find a place to stay for the time being. Wait, but I literally own this. Thanks for showing me around. No. I appreciate the kindness you've shown me, Courier. 
Please, come find me when you have a chance. I could use your help. Okay, Bellevue Bill, don't just... Where are you going, Bellevue? You mother... The world as we know it. Alright, Bellevue Bill. You just walk away. I'm gonna take a dump in my personal casino. We'll be back, everyone. Alright, so we are back here. It's been a little bit. Bellevue Bill's just chilling out. What's new? Not much. You said to come by or something? Also, tell me about Seattle right now. It's cool, rainy, sort of drab, but it's got its own unique atmosphere and elements. Some of the people are pompous, leather-bound briefcases, and call couches sofas and shit, but it's chill. I don't know what that sofa thing was. I don't understand the words you say, Bellevue Bill, but I love you. You said you need some help? Why are your clothes so clean? What, soap didn't survive the apocalypse? It's called having style, chump. You wash your clothes with soap? I usually use spit. What type of gun is that? This little cookie cutter. Why, it's a nickel-plated, custom-barreled shooting hand cannon. I mean, it's a pistol. This shit'll make you look like a hefty bag full of vegetable soup. Okay, Bellevue Bill. You said you need some help and stuff or something? Yeah, I did. I'm beyond homesick, my friend. I can't even describe it. I need a sense of self. Something to feel at ease again. I told you I used to do radio. Oh, I noticed radio was one thing that has survived. I saw an old station by the powder ganger camp you showed me. With your help, I'd like to put something together. Oh my god, is this another radio mission? What, what is going on? Who is making all these radio quests? Sure, I can help. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go find that station. Oh, Jesus. We're gonna help him build a radio station. Stasis pods killed the radio star. Stasis pods killed the radio. Take Bill to Lone Wolf. <gasps> Ooh, Lone Wolf Radio. That was cut content, I believe. And somehow I have it discovered, but not... <laughs> I have this discovered, but not the Legion encampment. Alright, here it is. Bellevue. Bellevue Bill. Checking out the radio. Wow. This place is pretty nasty, but I've made magic with less. Like a Snickers candy bar? Around. There's a radio tower down the hill a bit. I'm gonna try to fix it, get it standing upright. If you can grab me some soap, a paint gun, and some kind of tank to power it, we'll be off to a great start. I need soap for. Help Bill find parts. Find Bill a paint gun, a flamer, drain flamer tank. And some a Brock soap. That's what he's talking about. Drain flamer tank. Okay. We can do that. A Broxo flamer and a paint gun. Alright, we'll be right back. Alright, everyone. So, typical Steve. We got him to uh, talk to his informant. Apparently, there's some whiskey fiends back here with just the supplies we need. So, we're going to head on back behind the Sunset Sarsaparilla plant. And see if they uh, they got the stuff we need. And uh, hey, I might I, we're gonna take it by force. Oh Jesus! I take it back. There's a lot of you. I don't know where the Abrox. So oh Jesus, Jerry! Going in. Going in close. Yeah. Damn it. Nice. And here's a prize. Oh my. Don't want to lose it. A Broxo in drain fuel and paint gun, paint gun, Broxo and drain fuel. Drain fuel, we got everything we need except for the paint gun. Uh, this mod does have custom music, so we will be checking out to see if uh, I will turn on the radio. We'll see uh, what how up? that goes. Hey! What's going down? I got everything. Snap, my man. I got the radio tower up while you were gone too, but I ran into a bit of a problem. What's up, Bellevue? The tower was really big, and there was no way I could lift it alone, so I went and asked a couple of those deadbeat powder gangers for help. 
They agreed to help, although when we were done, they told me I owed them 2,000 caps. They told me if I didn't pay, they'd rip down the tower and... And? And put a stick of dynamite in my ass and light it. Help me, Courier. I don't have 2,000 caps. I do have this. You should be able to sell or switch it somewhere. Take it, please. Paint gun. Oh, wait. Holy shit. Okay. What's new? I mean... Why are you paying these guys? Why don't we fight them? Cause I guess he... You do say date or lewd. Is it... Is it separate? I don't know. It isn't. Alright. You're not... You're not gonna get a lot for this. I'm just saying. I don't think you understand how things work. I mean, I guess you do, since you're asking me to do this. Alright. I... What time is it? Is anyone awake? 3.35. Well, I guess we'll wake Chet up. Hey, ass face! Hey, dick hole! What, 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 what are you sleeping for, huh? 3.40 in the morning? Wow. Late sleeper, everyone. You looking to buy some supplies? No, of course not. Look, I'm here to sell. Can do. All right, that's whatever, dude. Jesus. Oh, God. Um, got this money. Thanks. And you have no money now. Give me a shout if you need anything. Yeah, I'm good. Andy? Jesus Christ, I hate him. All right, let's get out of here. I don't, I don't think this is going to work. Because I probably should have been given... Yeah, we'll find out. Hey, hey, you got a bed in here. Oh, wow, you made this nice. This nice. Wait, what do you, hey. What's new? I uh, did that thing in exchange for pre-war money for caps. Yeah, buddy. Did you get 2,000 for him, or was there more? I think there was more. Just 2,000, there was a bit more. Nice. I was hoping for an extra bit to help me buy some necessities around here. Well, you ready to wrap this up? Let's go. All right. I need you to take position behind that billboard near Camp North. I will go down and exchange the caps to the fuckheads. I need, I need you to stay put there. If you come out or shoot them, I'm fucking dead. Dead. Don't engage them first. They're letting us through. If something goes wrong, then yes, by all means, intervene. Unless that happens, though, just stay put. Got it? All right, let's go. I mean, I got it. I don't know if my companions got it. Did everyone hear what he said? Alright. They're probably gonna attack me. There's no way. Well, unless it's custom NPCs, which I guess it would be. Holy shit. Don't mind us. Me and my gang of misfits were just going behind this billboard to touch ourselves. Alright, everyone get back here. Everyone, everyone get back here. Sniper cover? Oh, Jesus. I mean, I, I guess... I don't know where he is. Oh, fuck. Oh, God, I'm sorry. Oh, Bellevue Bill, I, I apologize. Oh, Jesus. Ball art. Okay, okay, he's down. Bellevue Bill, this is all gone to shit. This is all my fault. I do. Let's travel back in time real quick. If I were Bellevue Bill, where would I be right now? If I were. Bevy you bill, where would I be right now? If I will bail you bill, where'd I be right now? If I will bail you bill, where would I be right now? Well let's take a look. I'm gonna look for Bellevue Bill. 
We're gonna find him so he can chill. Walking and talking, that's what they do. Belleville, Bill, where are, are you on? Belleville, Belleville, Bill, Belleville, Belleville, Bill, look it. It's Bellevue Bill, where are you? Bellevue Bill, home oh, Bellevue. Ball arms too, walking away to take a poo. Oh, Bellevue. Bellevue Bill, where have you gone today? Mm-mm-mm. Hip 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 hooray. Mm-mm. My middle name is Jay. Mm-mm-mm. I fought a dog today. Mm-mm-mm. That's all. So Bellevue Bill appeared last time, but then we had to fight everyone, so that's not good. Also, Bellevue Bill, you seem far too comfortable with the fact that everyone you've ever known is dead. Are you going to appear now, Bellevue Bill? I bet you're going to appear now. Oh, oh, it's my fault. This is fat oh, there he is. You coming over to talk to me? All right. It's done. Oh. Well, how'd that go? Oh, it was just peachy, you know. We laughed, we joked. We had a real fucking blast. I can't tell if you're being sarcastic. Oh. Shit. I think you killed, like... And now you can kill them. Okay. M much better, Bellevue. I like the way you're thinking. Jesus, Bellevue. Good God. Oh my God. Oh, geez, there's so many. <laughs> so many. God. How many of them are there? These ones can't even move. Oh. Jesus. <laughs> Congratulations. Wow, that was a lot of people. Bellevue Bill, I haven't killed that many people in a while. I mean, actually, maybe like four weeks ago. Checkpoint Gary was a lot of people. Is that three weeks ago? Probably three weeks ago. All right. Good work, everyone. I don't know where Bellevue Bill went. He always disappears. All right. Okay, I'm gonna go back to Lone Star Radio. Who the fuck are you? Oh. Who are you? All right, so we're back here. Uh, I made sure that he's essential. Cause I don't know if he was, but he is essential now. Holy shit! And we do have quest markers now on everyone, so that oh god. Jeez. Keep an eye on him. Ooh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, no, baby. N no, I don't want to do any of that. Shit, where did he go? Okay, there he is. Are you ready? Probably not. Did you die? What up, though? What What did you just say? 
Did, oh, God. Hey, we're gonna kill the rest of these dickheads. Don't go anywhere. Don't do anything. Just stay there. Oh, yeah, I'm the murderer. Alright, we good? Stasis pods killed the radio star, don't you know it? Look, you look so relaxed. What's going down? I... what now? I've got a radio station to run. There's some things that have been left undone, though. Come by the station sometime and we can get things moving again. Are you worried the powder gang is gonna retaliate? Two guys walk into the desert and face over 40 men. Two guys walk out. I think they get the message. All right. Dater lewd. You just said dater lewd. Okay. Hey, I know this girl named Willow. I think she's dead. Not completely sure. It's been a really long time. Yes, Steve, I don't know. I mean, I know we're kind of freelancers and we kind of help with anything. But we did help with a radio station and now it's another radio station. I, I know, I don't, I know, I don't, I don't got a good feeling about this either. You know, I never heard about that other radio station afterwards also. Alright everyone, this is the point of the mod where we turn on the radio and see if my video is immediately copyright strict, stri copyright stricken. It's gonna be, oh god. Your style is unorthodox. It is not the art, but the combat that you enjoy. I'm live evil, X-Men with two sequels, mutant MC, attract mics like Magneto, ridiculous wordsmith and mad lyricist, symbiotic virus attack like syphilis, massive pain inflictor, boa constrictor, plate tectonic shifter, rap style off the Richter, when cats uh. see me coming, I can hear their feet shuffle, walk my pants uh. street, but I'm the one Shake with that the ass. Monster. subterranean creature, Shake that ass. Leader. I'm a three-headed dragon, so call Shake me that ass. drink Listerine and brush my teeth Shake more, that ass. so I can sound fresh and say some dope Shake shit. That ass. The ill track mangler, the hills come on, Steve, come on. Wild cowboy, two come on. posters on my wranglers, bold legs and arms. Steve. Watch my sock, please. Steve. Like All right, fine. Okay, All right, well, that's Lone Wolf Radio. Pretty cool. How do you like it? I'm sure some of you are screaming, that's not lore friendly. Well, two men just fought off 40 men with the help of a Deathclaw, a Red Roach, and a Ghoul, and a Protectron. All right, who the fuck are you? Keep an eye out for trouble. You look like trouble, Hillary. I have trust issues. I mentioned that before. Where's... Oh, hi. What's new? D nothing. Uh, who's, who's that girl? Oh, that's Hillary. We met at the old Mormon fort. She's a follower's guard. We're, uh, kind of a thing now. That's disgusting. You people make me sick. You need help with anything? Yeah, actually, I've been thinking about that night. If I woke up in a pot at the bottom of the lake, I suppose there's a chance my friends did too. Probably not. I'm gonna say no. I need to know what happened to my friends, Mason Majors and Red October. Is that... Oh my god. You sound like a real good friend. Do you have any idea where to look? Oh my god. All you ever talk about is the past this and the past that. Who the, who the hell cares? Where should I look? One of my friends, Mason Majors, was an Air Force guy. He lived in the base housing near Nellis. The only place I can think to look is his house. Okay, let's go. After you? Don't you mean you after Owl? The hunt for Red Octo October. Why is your friend's name spelled like that? Find Billy Ma Madison's major house. Oh shit. Never mind. Mm. Oh wait. Mm. Mm. Look at what we got here, big boy. Alright, alright, alright. It's time to tell everyone Alexis or something. We got a floating beer, dude. A floating beer. Not floating anymore. 
Ma Mason Major's personal computer.